Yeah, I fail at not procrastinating, but my partner understands because he's the same way. So we're up until 12.30 and we're just like, do you know how to do this? No, no, I don't know either. And so we didn't get, even get half of it done yesterday because neither of us knew how to do it. Neither of us even know how to run our programs. Like, we've had two projects and they're both, you have to run them with command line arguments. Neither of us know how to do that. So we're just turning in our completely untested code. <laughs> it's really, really pathetic. <laughs> we're like, eventually we're gonna have to figure this out. It's apparently not going away. <laughs> but, yeah, if anyone, like, is, like, knows how to program and knows how to, like, use, use Eclipse and make it run with program, ar like, arguments, that would be, um, if you want to share that knowledge, I would owe you one. Because I don't have a freaking clue. They showed us once, but I don't even remember at all. Um, I'm I'm new to Eclipse, and it really is not my favorite thing in the world. <laughs> but what can you do? Uh, what else? Richard Dawkins is coming to OU tomorrow. Uh, I have I'm I'm gonna go see him because I have to do a speech critique for uh, public speaking. Uh, and so I'm going to critique Richard Dawkins as, as, as long as I can, like, you know, get in the, get in the building since I have work till 5 and he's at, well, he's at 7, so I'll probably be alright. But there's going to be, like, loads of people there, I bet, because it's not just, like, college students that are going to show up. It's, it's, it's going to be pretty cool, I think. Speaking of people that, um, came to OU and it was cool, Roy Zimmerman came to OU on Sunday. Uh, if you haven't heard of Roy Zimmerman, he's on YouTube. Go look him up. Actually, I'll put a I'll put a link over uh, ov over there, uh, so you can go find him and listen to his amazing, hilarious political satire, cause he's amazing. <laughs> like when he came on Sunday, it was terrific. I was like singing along the whole time. Uh, and it was probably annoying the people next to me. I, I went with um, a couple people from uh, GLBTF because no one had really heard about it. OU Improv, who hosted him, did a really horrible job of advertising. And I say this with love because one of my friends is in OU Improv, but they really did a horrible job of advertising. It's like, it's like I am subscribed to him on YouTube and I'm good friends with someone in the improv. You think I'd have heard about this, but no, I haven't. Uh, until, like, Sunday night when... Uh, one of my friends was like, uh, when when I was going to the camp, and one of my friends was like, Ryan Zimmerman's here, wanna go? And I'm like, sure! <laughs> so we went, and it was glorious, and he played all sorts of stuff, all, he played Defenders of Marriage, Creation Science, um, Inglace, I love Inglace, Inglace is hilarious! <laughs> um, uh, T Ted Haggard, of course he played Ted Haggard, uh, and then, like, after the break, he played a bunch of new stuff. They set up a webcam, or they, not a, they set up, like, a video camera in the middle of the room. And I'm like, oh, I hope this means he's gonna play new stuff. He totally played new stuff. He played one song so new, uh, that, like, he was joking that the ink hadn't dried yet. <laughs> he was, like, reading off the, off the song sheet, and he kept screwing up, but it was still really funny, because it was, it was a great song. It was about Rush Limbaugh. I can't sing it because I don't know the tune of Limbo, but you've basically got the gist of the song. Because uh, um, Rush Limbo is not very well. Limbo was a good choice. Because um, Rush Limbo always seems to be lowering the bar. Um, anyway, not to stray too far into politics and the ridiculous things Rush Limbaugh does and says and just in general Rush Limbaugh is ridiculous. Uh what else is there? I think I've probably talked long enough. I never remember to look and see how long I've been talking. I I I probably like talked ages now, like last time when I talked so long I had to cut it into two really long videos. <laughs> Sorry about that guys. Um, uh, but, yeah, that's probably, oh, wait, one more thing, uh, I don't remember if I've told you about this or not, uh, it's, it's been so long since I posted here, god, uh, but I have this friend who, like, w 
was saying that she was all supportive when I came out to her, you know, but she had a really hard time using the right pronouns, using the right name, that kind of thing. And so today I was eating dinner. She 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 works at the cafeteria, and today I was eating dinner, and I ran into her, and and we got talking, and uh, her her like I guess supervisor or whatever came out and was joking with her that what are you doing? I th I see you're socializing, and. So, just after that, I was like, oh, I should let you get back to work, and, and, and he's like, oh, no, you don't have to go, and I'm like, no, that's okay, and, and, uh, and she says, uh, no, she, uh, she needs to go, or she's gonna go, or whatever, and, and then, like, as I was walking away, she says, I mean, he, he, he needs to go, and, and she just, and it was, and it was, like, it was, it was, it was pretty great, because, I mean, it, it, it didn't matter at that point what's been said, has been said, but, like, it, it, it mattered in a different way, you know, because, like, she's actually trying now. She wasn't really before, and, and now it's, I, probably my voice is part of it. <laughs> she's probably like, oh, uh, yeah, <laughs> that's, that's, like, actually happening now. It's, it's probably what's going through her head, I don't know. But, that would be, that would be good. Now if, now if the other guy at the calf, um, this, this guy who, who's, who's, who's always at the door taking IDs, uh, and he always demands me, now if he would just get a clue, that would be terrific, but what can he do? Uh, and anyway, I think that will do it for this, for, for this vlog here, because I, again, I don't know how long I've been talking, and I have fanfiction to write. So, I will talk to you at some point in the future, uh, hopefully sooner than the interval that's gone by now. <laughs> and I will try to keep it short next time. Talk to you guys later.